We're in Lynchburg, Virginia, which is in the southwest part of Virginia. This motel is a 92-room motel, all wood frame construction with a sprinkler system in it. The owners came to us back about a year and a half ago and wanted us to price it up and build a building for them. So we turned around and started pricing it up and got a lot of different prices from different people. And we actually ended up getting 84 lumber to price it. And the biggest thing was that I was looking at was schedule. And man, they were right on the schedule. They told us when they were going to get it done. And we, even with all the rain and everything, they worked through the weekends to try to meet our schedule and everything. So they did a good job on that. It's real easy. When my estimator estimates it, we don't know if he's got it all or not. And when you turn around and have somebody that's going to do it turnkey, we don't have to worry about not having all the material that you need. And that's a big item right there because you could lose a lot of money just in not having the material that you need when, if the estimator mess, makes a mistake. Once we had the concrete in, they started from the ground floor all the way up, did all the framing, all the subframing, set all the trusses, all the floor trusses, framed up all the rooms, did all the blocking inside for us. They were also pricing up going back in and doing some of the trim work and stuff in all the rooms too. And on the labor side, you know, a lot of times we turn around and sub everything out anyway, but with 84 lumber doing it turnkey, there's no really fighting of who cut a two before short and then had to throw it away because it wasn't any good. It's all basically 84's responsibility, so we don't have to worry about that on the labor side. And then if we need extra men out here, you just make a phone call and tell them, get us some more men. It made it real life real easy when I was able just to call Ben and tell him I needed some more men. It made my life easy just making that one phone call to be able to get one person out here instead of having multiple people to be able to turn around and try to get all the different subs and stuff out here. It definitely made it easy with just one person. In uh, the state of Virginia now, you have to have a third party inspector to come in and inspect the building. And the guy that came in here out of Northern Virginia, where they have done a lot of inspections up there, he said that this was the best inspection he ever had. The best. He went through, he said usually it would take eight to 10 hours or even longer to come through and inspect the building. He said once he got in here and seen the quality of the framing, he said he, he actually inspected this building in three hours, which was amazing. So that just tells you the quality that y'all do.